Hey CG, I'm Ellie. And I'm Jordan. And we have your CG TV broadcast for Friday, March 10th, 2017. First up today, let's take a look at the weather with Nick Matze. Hey CG, today's weather is going to be sunny but still cold. If you're going to the boys basketball game this weekend, be careful because ice conditions are possible. Other than that, I have a great cold weekend. Back to you. Thanks Nick. Next Tuesday is a busy day at CG. During Star on Tuesday is the next STEM club meeting. This is Pi Day. Join us for Pi Day activities in room 552. You won't want to miss it. Tuesday night is also the Greater Indianapolis College Fair, which will be held at the UND Dome from 6.30 to 8 p.m. Students will be able to visit with over 90 in-state and out-of-state college-slash-university representatives. Students must pre-register for the fair. Please see your star teacher or counselor if you need information on how to register for the college fair. Also on Tuesday, CGHS will be hosting its first talent show at 6 p.m. in the auditorium. This Tuesday, CG students are putting on a talent show. At 6 p.m. that evening, the different acts will showcase their abilities for a crowd. The event gives students with unique skills a chance to show off. Some groups, like the drumline, dance team, and Shaboom will be performing, along with soloists, spoken word artists, piano players, and tap dancers, to name just a few. Tickets for the show are $5. Come out and support your friends on Tuesday in the auditorium. Tickets are $5 and can be purchased in the auditorium on the day of the performance. Come out and support your peers to see the wide variety of talent we have here at Center Grove. Next week, there will be a call-out meeting for students interested in trying out for fall and or winter cheerleading on March 15th at 6 p.m. in the cafeteria. Please bring a parent. Attention students who need driver's ed. The CIESC driver's ed course in the traditional classroom will be from April 17th through May 4th from 3 to 5.30, Monday through Thursday at Center Grove High School. You must register by April 12th at www.driversedsafety.com. Please check the lost and found table located at the back of the cafeteria for any items you may have lost. All items will be cleaned out March 16th. Attention all members of Book Forum. Our next two meeting dates have changed. We will meet on Thursday, April 6th to discuss the sky is everywhere. The final meeting will be on Thursday, May 11th to discuss the love that split the world. We will meet in room 162 at 7 a.m. Are you interested in local politics and getting to know your elected officials? If so, join Kopi today during STAR in welcoming Jack Sandlin, who is the Greenwood representative for the state legislator. He's coming to speak about state politics and his experience as a lawmaker. This event is open to the whole student body and we would like to have as large a showing as possible. If interested, come to the library right after this broadcast. Good luck to the boys basketball team who plays in the regional tournament against New Albany and Seymour tomorrow at 10 a.m. If victorious, they will play for the championship at 8 p.m. at Seymour. Also tomorrow, the boys and girls track teams compete at the Whiteland Qualifier at UND. Jade Clenny has a preview of the boys season ahead. The boys track team's spring season has just begun. They are set and ready for the hard work ahead with a set of goals. Our goals for this season, the 2017 season, are like they are any other season. You know, we want to compete to win the state championship. Within that, we want to try to do as well as we can in the top three or four in the mix. We want to win our sectional, win the county for the 20th straight year. We want to uh, attempt to be the first or second team in the region and try to get at least 15 guys qualified to the state track meet hopefully a relay or two, and five or six individuals. Different events means different athletes to compete for the win. Being a distance runner, obviously, we put in a lot of miles. Um, 800 guys usually do like six mile long runs, and then two miles around eight or nine miles, so it ends up being 30, 40 miles a week. I run the sprints for Center Grove, and you know, running the sprints and everything, you know, it's fun and everything. I like, you know, that the race is not that long, and you know, you come out of blocks, and everything, every part of your race has to be exactly right. And you know, just winning state and everything would be mean everything to me. So that's my goal this season. Our uh, running hurdles is really fun because it's just a super intense event, and you have to really, really do the same thing every single time you run. You have to make sure your, your steps are really specific, and 
I really like high jump because it's just really fun to jump and see how high you can get and always try to beat your personal best every week. The relays are nice to run because I'm doing it with my teammates that I've worked hard with um, all year, even though it's pretty tiring. Practicing every day after school, the boys each have things they are excited for this season. I'm really excited for the state tournament this year. I think I could do really well and place really high. And then for high jump, I'm super excited to try to break, break the uh, school record in the next few days. I'm extremely excited to run at New Bounce Nationals in New York City. Um, I think you know I could definitely have some great opportunity for me. I'm also excited to go to Indoor State and do well there and you know, go through my entire season and go through sectionals, regionals, and then eventually go to state finals and hopefully play some of my races. I'm excited to finally get back from an injury since I wasn't able to run last year, and I'm hoping that our 4x4 team can get to state again. I'm excited to run an outdoor mic and see how we do and also compete in the 4x800 and the open 800. They will run this weekend at the Whiteland Qualifier with hopes of qualifying for the indoor state meet over spring break. All the rest of the year is great and it's uh, it's a you know it's it's icing on the cake, but we really want to be great in June for the state track meet. And that's all we have for you today, CG. Bye. Bye.